Hello and welcome to our first video tutorial for Paperless, the imaging solution by Mariner Software. Now in this tutorial, we'll learn about the system requirements, how to install the software, and how to register the program. Let's get started. Now in order to run Paperless, you need to be running Mac OS 10.5 or higher. Now you can tell which version of the Mac operating system you're running by clicking on the Apple menu and choosing About This Mac. Next, the hard disk space requirements for Paperless will vary depending on how much and what type of information you want to store in your library. The application itself takes about 12.7 megabytes of hard disk space. To find out how much space you have available, from the Go menu, choose Home, and then look at the bottom of the window. As you can tell, I have plenty of space. Let's go to the Mariner software site. Now we hope that you'll visit this site often and find out about the rest of the software that we offer, but for now, let's concentrate on Paperless. Click on the Download button. The download page appears. Scroll down to Paperless and click on the link. Now, if you're new to Mariner software, the download file page appears. In order to cut down on spam, we ask that you fill out the download registration form. Fill out your first name, your last name, your email address, and then specify your operating system. Finally, click on the Submit button. Once you click on the Submit button, you'll receive an email from us to complete the registration process. Go to your email account and locate the email we've sent you. You may have to check your spam folder to locate it. Once you find the email, click on the link to confirm the registration, which will take you back to the Downloads page. And by the way, you'll only have to do this once. Now that you're back at the download page, scroll down to Paperless and click on the link to start the download. The download window appears and the software will be downloaded to your computer. Now depending on your connection speed, the download time will vary. Now once the software has been downloaded to the computer, this installer window will appear. If it doesn't, we need to locate and launch the DMG file. Go to your Spotlight search field in the upper right hand corner of your screen and search for the paperless.dmg file. Once you locate it, double-click it to launch the installer. Once the installer window is open, simply drag the paperless file over to the application shortcut folder. Now, open the application shortcut folder and locate the paperless application file. If you want to launch the program from your dock, simply drag the icon over to the dock and you're all set. Now to install the software from a CD, place the CD into your drive label side up, wait for the CD image icon to appear, and then double click on it. Next, double click on the paperless folder and the installer window will appear. Simply drag the paperless file over to the application shortcut folder, locate the file in the applications folder, and then drag it over to the dock for easy launching. OK, let's talk about registration. Click on the paperless button. Now if you've downloaded Paperless, the security window will appear. Click on the Open button. Review the license agreement, and if you're amenable to the terms and conditions, click the Agree button. The Welcome window appears. We're going to assume that you've taken Paperless out for a test drive and have purchased a license and a serial number. Click on the Enter Serial button. The Buy Now button takes you to the Mariner Software site to purchase a license and your own serial number. The Cancel button allows you to continue using the software until the demo period expires. Let's register paperless with the serial number you've purchased. Simply enter your name, the organization if applicable, and the serial number just the way you received it from us including any dashes and capitalization, and then finally click the OK button. OK, so that wraps it up for this first tutorial. For more information, please consult your user guide or visit our website and access our knowledge base in the support area. You can also contact